And just before five o'clock this afternoon, officers came across a vehicle that they had identified as being involved in a possible carjacking out of Arapahoe County. Uh, the officers then contacted that vehicle in the parking lot here at 12th and Federal. Uh, during that contact, the parties fled from the vehicle. Uh, the officers gave chase for three individuals that were taken into custody. Um, and at some point, there was a party that produced a handgun uh, and the officer discharged his weapon. Uh, and as you know, these are very uh, thorough investigations. This is going to take some time. As you know, we still have the crime scene uh, locked down here. So that's about all the information that we have to pass on at this point. Did the suspects fire that handgun? Well, that's all part of the investigation. Uh, we do know that at least one of our officers, or an officer, discharged the weapon, and that is the cause for such a full investigation. Was the suspect hit? Um, I, I can't really get into that. Uh, I really don't know for sure whether or not that, that is the case. Uh, but again, we have the scene locked down. We have our homicide unit, which does the investigations into uh, any type of officer-involved shooting. So that's typical. We have a number of officers on scene. Again, the, the area is shut down. We're speaking with anyone who may have had information, may have seen anything, heard anything uh, that would be of value to our investigation. So it's ongoing. 12th and Federal, what, what business is that? I, 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 I don't know off the top of my head. It's okay. just on the street. Can you understand? Is it the standard or standard? You know, but I don't, I don't. That's all part of what the investigators would be trying to put together as, as we speak. They're looking at that. How do they know they alerted to the car being here? Did they see it in their Volvo out or something for that vehicle? How do they track these suspects down to this area? I'm not sure at this point. I really don't know. Um, this is, the, this is the limited information that we have to pass on to you guys at this point. And again, we wouldn't want to pass on any information that's going to hurt our investigation down the road. Do you know when the carjacking occurred in Arapahoe County? I don't. We had heard something about our RTD station, that it might have happened there. Have you heard anything I, about that? I really don't have any information on how, how or when it happened in Arapahoe County, but the investigators will be looking for Any injuries in the carjacking? Uh, not that I'm aware of, but again, you would have to reach out to Arapahoe County to ask those questions. Some of the witnesses thought that the suspects had ran into a home nearby. Is that something that you're aware of? Was there ever a barricaded situation? Were they trying to get people out of a home? I have not heard that there was a barricaded situation. I know that there were. Uh, it, there was at least one school that was placed on lockdown, which is typical uh, in this type of a situation. But beyond that, I have not heard that there was any type of barricade situation. And do you know how many shots were fired by the single officer? It sounds like. Well, that was that would certainly be part of the of the ongoing investigation. But was it just one officer that fired? Again, part of the investigation. But I can confirm this was an officer involved shooting. We did have uh, an officer that discharged the weapon. But you don't know at this point if someone was hit? Uh, I, I, I don't know that information. But three in custody? Three in custody is, is what I understand at this point. Any age, sex? I, I don't know. I don't know. But as okay. we get information, we can certainly pass it on to you. Can you talk about some okay. of the closures here? that are in place? Uh, well, we have uh, west of here at Federal and 10th that's closed all the way up to Federal and 12th to the west. Uh, that was a containment area uh, for any suspects that may have been on foot fleeing from the officers. Uh, and that's the area that we still have locked in. Any idea how much longer you guys are going to be out here? Uh, probably some time. Uh, again, whenever we uh, are investigating an officer involved uh, shooting, uh, those, those take a little more time. Is there any transport to the hospital? I, I don't know. And do you know where, yeah, I mean, it's kind of a large scene, where the shooting took place? Um, you know, uh, I have that information, but I haven't been cleared to pass it on. That's all I've got. All right. Good, guys? Yep, thank you. All right. Thank you.